wake up, start smoking a spliff. <coughs> start choking this shit. Eh? I look around, seen a ghost in this bitch. But I don't trust a soul, so the toast is grip, the clip fly and I get high, I get high, I get high. Eh? That's what I happen to It is man salute to the subscribers that notification gang etc etc don't let none of that get too far ahead of you you know who i be follow me on ig fight underscore fly tell you my mind say hi shout out to my guy showtime sp and everybody who watches this content whether religiously or in passing so you see the title the math ain't mathing shout out to math hoffa and everything that he's got going on my expert opinion all of the moves that he's made, you know what I'm saying, to the BET joint, he's been moving on, and he started in battle rap, you know what I'm saying, he started in battle rap as a battle rapper, had ups, had downs, had a pretty, you know, serviceable career, uh, you know, was on one of the first Summer Madness, Summer Madness 2, you know what I'm saying, he had the battle versus Calico, etc., etc., he had a famous beef with Surf, I actually did the blog, how Math Hopper's beef with Sue Surf ended his battle rap career. And it actually did pretty well. That was a couple months ago. And now I'm like having to like revisit the Math Hopper subject. So um, I do, you know what I'm saying, see what Math has been doing. I've seen how he's been blowing up. The numbers on my expert opinion, he's almost had a million subscribers over there. But there's been a lot of controversy along the way, you know what I'm saying? It's been a lot of controversy, ups, downs, and, and et cetera, et cetera. From his first guest, whether it be Space Ghost, Heineken, uh, Misfit, Knowledge to God, the Mav have a revolving door. One thing you know when you go on Mav's show, you won't be there long. You know what I'm saying? It's uh, in and out, in and out, in and out. And it's normally about money, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna hold you. Most of the complaints and grievances and jargon that I've seen with Mav and previous co-hosts is usually about money, right? So, you know, continue to do his thing. He revolutionized a lot of the barbershop talk, built his platform basically off of just random barbershop gossip. He started, you know, with the hip hop, with the battle rap first. He had a lot of battle rappers in there. Then he transitioned, started getting big name guests, The Baby, uh, he had Ja Rule, uh, Fat Joe, you name it, they were there. You know what I'm saying? Dave East, etc., etc. And he became one of the biggest platforms, you know what I'm saying? You got Joe Budden Podcast, uh, Million Dollars Worth of Game, and right with those names, my expert opinion uh, was there. You know, and then we fast forward, you know, and so that's just the success. Shout out to Mav Hoffa. We get to the situation where we at today. I was hearing about it, you know what I'm saying? I had heard about it a bunch of times and things like that. What had went on with the Bimmy and uh, Champ stealing the credit card or taking the credit card and trying to buy a bunch of shit from the Apple store. And then, you know, the nigga never, Champ never explained what had happened. And whatever the case may be, I saw it. I never spoke about it, but I just saw it, you know what I'm saying? And Mav had continued to go into these online wars and beefs with different people. Hassan Campbell, China Brim. I don't know who told you to go over there fucking with them niggas. I don't know who told Math to go over there fucking with them old five. <laughs> them niggas ain't got no sense. <laughs> Shout out to them niggas, but they go the extra mile. Like, they call the dark side for a reason. You don't, you know how your mama tell you? Your mama tell you, you go to the store, you come back home. Don't you go out there fucking with them niggas. That's what you did. You went out there messing with the wrong niggas. <laughs> and they on your ass. I ain't gonna hold you, math. But the math ain't math, and I'm gonna say here's where some of the problems, you know what I'm saying, kind of lie. Uh, this audio and the video, you know what I'm saying, they're putting it out saying Math Hoffa put the beats by Dre on his girl or whatever the case may be. She's up in the video, it looks uncomfortable. He deleted the live and then he went and addressed it again or whatever the case may be saying that people added the audio and the smack. I'm really here because this landed on Tasha K. You know what I'm saying? This scenario has now landed on Tasha K. Man, when you land on Tasha K, we gotta speak about it. You know what I'm saying? Because Tasha K, it's the first of the month, baby. This is a top. This is a topic and you came from battle rap. Now, I don't see many people defending math, and I have watched a couple blogs and things like that earlier. And so, you know, battle rap, there's really nothing going on, you know what I mean? So I looked into it, and I kind of like looked at what was going on to see why does math have so many enemies, and why do so many people hate what he's got going on? This, listen, this type of content is better than any content I ever heard. Math, we appreciate it. We appreciate you coming to the dark side because we is having some great content and I'm meeting some great friends. 
I didn't know so much people disliked you. Now, um, Math was in a relationship. Math, this is infidelity. We thought you was a good, I seen you with your wife on live. You was kissing on her. You was making her feel appreciative. I hope I said that right. Now, you know, like I said earlier, he's doing my expert opinion. He's almost at a million subscribers and I'm sure he's gonna continue to do what he do, you know what I'm saying? I seen uh, Tasha K was talking, like I said, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't flag me, flag, no math, flag, don't flag this, you know what I'm saying? Cause that's not what this is. This is just, you know, the subscribers, the fan base, they wanna know what's going on. You got in the beef with Hassan Campbell and the dark side together, nigga, what are you thinking about? Both of them, you can't, you cannot take both of them out. No, 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 math, that ain't, <laughs> ain't gonna happen. Hassan Campbell been around forever, bro. These, some of these people been around forever and do 100,000 views a video, 30,000 views a video, 50,000 views. That do them views on you in no time. You know what I'm saying? Um, but here's the deal. Like I said, your girl, you gotta get your girl off camera, bro. Like all of that, I seen the video, because I seen the video that you did, the one you took, I seen the one you did, that you took down, and I saw the one that you left up. Bro, when you addressing shit, shit's going on in life, bro, when your girl is in the background hyping it up like, yeah, and nah, we got money to get, bro, man, now nah, your wife, man, you gotta, she got, she has got to move out of the camera. I'm like, oh. Uh... <laughs> and the reason why she's got to move out of the camera is because once you put her in the spotlight, you can't take the spotlight off of her. So you don't ever bring her in it, so you ain't got to take her out of it. And... I, like I said, I know Mav is a little angry and frustrated at all of the people that's talking and things like that. But like I said, you've built a career and a platform about talking about everybody else's business. You know what I'm saying? That's what you did. Shine versus URL, this person versus that person, Mook and Briz and Rex and this and that. We remember all of these things. You know what I'm saying? Great content. You do great numbers. We know your platform. I hope Eminem goes on there one day and so on and so forth. But what you gotta remember is that you can't stop your ops. Let you said, oh, you sound like it's drama, though. It sound like it's beef, though. It, like, it, 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 I mean, I'm listen, I'm with all kind of smoke, man. Cigars, cigarettes, you know, the, the regular joints. I mean, where you at? <laughs> let's, just, let's just make that the thing. You can't stop your ops, because they gonna go all out. They don't forget. All right, so homeboy stole the credit card, whatever the case may be, dirty nigga, etc. You know what I'm saying? With the dirty move that he did. I saw him on a podcast with Queens Flip, because you know they're sending it now. They're sending all the clips now. Do you see this, see this, see this? Y'all was on the phone arguing like three months ago when he told you he had pictures and he had videos. What did you think he, what did you think he was alluding to? <laughs> you know what's crazy? He's sitting there saying dumb shit. No one I can say five words and break this nigga's fucking life down. You can say whatever the fuck you want to say, nigga. I got pictures and text messages, nigga. Fuck you talking about? Nah, nah. You want to put him on the phone? You allowing this, Flip. You allowing this. I am. You allowing this. You knew you allowing it. Right, let him say what he going to say. Let him say what he going to say. Let him say what he going to say. Nigga, I got pictures and text messages, nigga. You know the shit that you be doing, nigga. You know the shit that you be doing. Yo, fuck out of here. When you get out here like, I fuck out of here. You know the shit that you be doing, nigga. I don't got nothing to say to that nigga, bro. Yo, hey, yo, man. Bro. Yo, this nigga stupid. You talking about fighting with you? You going fight with a J, nigga. You got me going fight with you going viral today, nigga. What did you think he was alluding to? <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. You got to be smarter than this, my nigga. Like, you alley-ooping shit to the ops now. You literally are alley-ooping shit to your ops to throw it down on you. You got to look at it like you way above these niggas. You don't see Vlad and academics and all of them really beefing with niggas that's below them because it's the reason why they're there and why you're here. You got almost a million subscriber channel and you beefing with niggas who got a couple hundred thousand. The math ain't mathin'. That's the reason why I'm saying the math ain't mathin'. You up here with the big dogs, the Joe Buttons, the, 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 the Wallows, the Gillies and all of them. You don't need to be down here arguing with people and doing this back and forth shit. 
and you can't turn it off once it's turned up. You done, you made a bunch of videos about Hassan Campbell. Last week I saw him, it was a bunch of them. Hassan, Scamble, Scamble, all that, I seen them shits, right? You can't choose what they do when they spin the block. You are not gonna get to choose. And then I guess, you know, you know, you're flagging channels, taking people's channels down, taking people's videos down. I guess, I mean, that's the thing, it happens all the time. I don't really use his content. I won't use maps, I won't use anybody's content because I could just speak about shit. Uh, my handle's that, I don't need all, I don't need all y'all videos to put them up in here, doctor them up, and talk crazy to you. Now, um, and like I said, this ain't, this is just a conversation. Cause like I say, math is, I fuck with math. I ain't got no issue with him. Like I said, <laughs> ain't no wreck, this is a check. Ain't no wreck. This is just a check. I ain't even gonna hold you. You know what I'm saying? The topic is here. It's the first of the month. Huh, math. <laughs> I'm gonna give you my. <laughs> I'm gonna give you my unpopular opinion, my nigga. You got the expert opinion. I got the unpopular opinion. The unpopular opinion is I think you should take your girl off that camera and don't put her back on there again. Quite obviously, she's not. Everybody ain't fit to be in that light. The only reason why we talking about this and why people is talking about this is because she sent them pictures to a nigga. <laughs> she sent them to a nigga. He got away with it. But he ain't get away with it. Who in turn gave them shits to, well, she sent them to Queen's Flip. I, that's pretty much what I'm hearing. She sent them to Queen's Flip. Queen's Flip is not going to be the type of nigga that want to out you himself, but he will give it to somebody else. He will give it to somebody else. That's what he did. Queen's Flip. And Queen's Flip always been messy. You know what I'm saying? I don't got no issue with the nigga personally, but he been a messy nigga from day one. He do messy shit. When he had the new champ up in there, he calls you, y'all on the phone arguing and shit. That ain't nothing but content. I knew Queen's Flip was messy as fuck when Tiana Taylor punched him in the face and he put the video out. I did three million views. I said, oh yeah, this is, this is, this is lame. It's just what he do. So, in turn, what I see here is... Mav gets into a situation with his girl, you know what I'm saying? That vid, that audio looks crazy. That, that that she got a scratch on her face, talking about she fell off the bed. What the fuck do y'all sleep on? Twin bunk beds? What kind of motherfucking bed did she fall off? And y'all niggas ain't even had the stories right. That's the craziest shit. Your story was saying one thing, her story was <laughs> You see what I'm saying? You keep your girl off the camera, none of this shit don't have to happen. It almost looked like she was being held hostage and shit. She's talking like, uh, when something happens between us, we just gonna keep it to us, bro. Like you know, math. No, 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 no. Justin Matthew, you should have seen how they had you. It was looking bad too. You know what I'm saying? Like them niggas, them dark side niggas is going crazy, running up numbers. That nigga said he said there was no content like the content that you could give him. <laughs> I wasn't gonna blog on it. When I see how them niggas was eating, I said, God damn, they making money like that? Come on, man, throw me up one too, man. God damn, man, you, you baking biscuits to feed the whole projects, my boy. You baking biscuits to feed the bread for the whole projects. And like I said, I got zero issue with math. But I have seen the repetitive flow of all of these different guests from the Bigger to Esso to Heineken to Misfit. Uh, all these other, there's a whole goddamn list of people that they saying that he done fell out with for whatever reasons or the court all these niggas that was on expert opinion at one time. All right, and so that's just that. And then the reason why I say uh, that Mav should like keep his family, keep his girl, keep all that shit offline is because when you, when y'all have issues, you can't choose how a nigga going to get revenge. You cannot choose. And then when they get revenge, it's, oh, I don't want to do this no more. Y'all bringing families, y'all bringing kids. Nigga, they, 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 the internet, ain't no rules in internet war. There is no rules in internet war. Them niggas will talk about your mom, your kid, your wife, your daughter, your neighbor. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, your girl is the one who embarrassed you. She brought that embarrassment to your door. Adam 22 wife is fucking niggas on camera and she ain't bringing him that kind of ridicule. You know what I'm saying? Like she literally sent them fucking pictures out. And when a woman sends some shit to a nigga, it's like, yo, this is what I'm going through. I want you to see this. It, you can't reel it back in later and be like, oh, nah, I was just kidding. That was from another situation. Do, 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 do. You look crazy. You know what I'm saying? And then Mav already fucking the disaster, Sirius Jones. Like, this is a nigga who known for physical altercations. You cannot give people no fuel. You sent them pictures. That's why them niggas is in a group. These niggas, bro, these niggas is literally in Zoom meetings with like three, four niggas in a box. They taking turns beating this nigga like a pinata. Bah! Bah! They pinata in your ass. Bro, it's too many forces, too many powers. They could beat your ass for a week. But Mav, at the end of the day, uh, you should go online, 
know what I'm saying? You could pay like $500 to $1,000 to keep somebody that's a crisis management and they do PR. You keep one around. I got somebody. You know what I'm saying? You pay them, you pay them for a couple months up front, a couple incidents. If something happens in life, they'll give you the best way to go about it, the best way to deviate it. Because your PR, for a nigga, <laughs> for a nigga who I know and I seen on the internet before I ever was on the internet, you got the worst PR skills ever. Like, what? Bro, like, this shit is crazy, my nigga. And you can't go back and forth with everybody. And you can't get everybody's channel taken down. You can't get everybody's channel flagged and all of that shit. Because that shit look damn near police. It's like, you can't swim. You cannot swim without getting wet. Ain't none of us perfect. We all had ups. We all had downs. We all done been in this game for years and years and years. But math, you cannot make a platform that's based off of everybody else's news, bullshit, ups, downs, happy, sad shit in life. And then when the fucking, when the, when the, when the Jehovah Witness knock at your door, you don't want to answer it. Oh, no, 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 it don't work like that. It don't work like that. These niggas was happy. Your ops was happy to put that shit out. And you alley-ooped it to them. You know what I'm saying? You alley when you did them videos and all that, you, you alley-ooped it to them. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't promote violence. I'm not with the domestic violence shit. I mean, even if he's saying that the sound was added and whoop de whoop de whoop, just that conversation with the B, get out of my house and all that, that's a lot. Just saying. And it don't make you look no better. And I know you're approaching a million subscribers and I know you're going to continue to do your views and shit like that and do what the fuck you do. But man, when, yo, when you put your family in a public light, you just got to know it never comes off. And people that know that they can't get you, they attack the people that you closest to. Everything from how they look, how they walk, how they talk, how they dress, how they act. Yeah, you put it in the light. You came to the battle rap event, nigga got security, y'all niggas had minks on and shit like that, looking like Frank Lucas in, in, the, in the fight. That's what y'all did. So, you know, when you play, when you, when you, when you go public, and then she takes the, the information and sends it to another nigga, <laughs> and she was out of bounds. <laughs> She was out of bounds. That shit is out of bounds. Fuck my bitch sending some shit to another nigga for. <laughs> Math, shout out to you. Uh, my answer to pain. I'm sure y'all niggas gonna continue to do y'all views and shit up there. But yeah, this is crazy, son. You you have to stop because you got too many ops. That's, I'm gonna leave it there to make it fair. You know what I'm saying? I even see the battle rap niggas. Chris and Bias even got a blog out about you. You know what I'm saying? Because like I said, you done talked about everybody's situation at some point. So... When you um, when them when them are the seeds you sow, you gotta watch the plants that grow. You know what I'm saying? So uh, hopefully it works out for y'all and y'all do what the fuck y'all gotta do. But yeah, all that family and all that shit on camera, man. Fuck all that. These niggas don't like you. These niggas ain't your friends. <laughs> I when I jump on this camera, I don't know. I don't. I, I don't. You don't even know if I'd have a girl. If I'm married. If I'm single. If I'm divorced. If I got one kid. If I got five kids. You don't need to know none of that shit. Cause ain't none of that shit important. Cause these niggas don't like you anyway. Other than that, shout out to the motherfucking subscribers. That notification gang. But math, math ain't math. And you gave them niggas the drop on you. What you think they gonna do? What do you think they gonna do? Exactly what the fuck they did. You know what I'm saying? Like. Champ, yeah, Champ, he took the nigga credit card and all of that, but he had something on you, and he couldn't wait for niggas to get it, because you burned him, and when he left the platform, he don't got a platform to work on no more, so he want to make sure everybody know whatever they want, they need to know. New high. Yeah. I wake up, start smoking a split. <coughs> Start choking this shit, eh? I look around, seen a ghost in this bitch But I don't trust a soul, so the toast is gripped The clip fly and 